jasonnewland.com This is Deep Sleep Whisper Hypnosis My name is Jason Newland And please only listen to this when you can safely close your eyes Now make sure that you're comfortable So if that means pressing a pause button, then pressing a play button when you're ready, that's fine. I'd like you to get in touch with how you feel emotionally, how you feel, not physically, but emotionally. of my chair <laughs> which I didn't realise was going to squeak until just then I'll try and sit still so what's going on in your mind in your brain right now as you're ready to go to sleep the question, are you ready to fall asleep? Because getting undressed into your bed clothes, laying down on your bed, getting into whatever comfortable sleeping position you prefer. There's a lot to say about that being a really good trigger for your body and your mind to know that it's time to sleep. So you may be physically prepared to sleep. Are you emotionally prepared to sleep? notice what's going on in your mind notice what emotions are there maybe it's frustration maybe anger maybe feelings of any kind during the previous day or perhaps you're thinking about something that you expect to happen tomorrow or in the next week or so like the tide it's like it's like the wind 
visceral sense of comfort that comes from that for me and maybe especially those of you that listen regularly to my voice can actually be affected by how I feel when I make these recordings and I always feel relaxed always feel sleepy even if I made this during the day and I was wide awake when I started and guaranteed within a few minutes everything would start to slow down internally closed I'm just aware of the moment just this moment it's almost as if nothing else matters at all Just in the same way, you don't keep washing up clean cups and clean dishes. You use them first, then you can wash them up and clean them. And because tomorrow hasn't even happened yet, there are 
set which comes naturally for anybody that's, that leaves it too long and doesn't sleep for a long time and then eventually your mind goes to sleep your body goes to sleep there's no choice in it it has to happen and it will happen always like just giving yourself to that feeling almost surrendering yourself to the natural rhythm of sleep that is within all of us that we were born ability to drift off to sleep so easily so naturally and it feels nice when you actually just lay there moment not wanting not needing anything and you expect to fall asleep because that's what's going to happen you expect to drift off because that is what's going to happen just like when you lay down on your bed you expect to feel relaxed because that what is going to happen you expect the bed to support your body because that is what is going to happen Thanks. 
plastic spoon and to feed yourself that needed to be taught to go to the toilet on your own needed to be taught sleeping didn't need any tuition whatsoever things that we've learned that have got in the way of us sleeping easily and naturally. Unlearn those things. Untie that particular knot. In your mind you can untie it now. And once it's untied, it stays Sorry.